the red pill, you know, alpha and beta, what it means to be beta, how not to be beta. I got all my stripes in this motherfucker, so just call me Colonel Cash out. You niggas like that. Let me show you how I'm coming. 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 Yeah, I know my, I know, I know my hair, I know my hair ain't dead, man. I gotta, I gotta get my hair braided again. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking a little crazy on here, but look, I just wanna, you know, hurry up and come on here and talk and stuff and get my inspiration out before it goes away. It's been, I've been trying to work this camera, my inspiration, believe me. But today we just gonna talk about compromise, specifically in a relationship with you and a little lady, or you and a man, or you know, just the relationship in general. But you know, I was watching this TV show, I was watching The Game. If y'all know what The Game is, they put it on Netflix with, with Tia. Tia and I love, I love Tia. Tia my celebrity cuz, Tia Murray. I love you, baby. But now, nah, um, I want to talk about compromise, man. And how it's important because, you know, y'all gotta understand it. In a relationship, compromise is super important. You, you have to be able to compromise. That's what's gonna make the relationship because if you can't compromise, then how the relationship gonna continue? You know what I'm saying? You you gotta compromise. Cause I understand, look, a lot of dudes, they've been introduced to the red pill, you know, alpha and beta, what it means to be beta, how not to be beta, the blue pill, all that stuff, right? That's cool, that's great. But y'all seem to forget, y'all trying to be super alpha and dominant and all that but y'all y'all for y'all missing the point relationships is supposed to be ran smoothly it's supposed to be in harmony okay you gotta have balance that's with anything in life you gotta be balanced so you gotta have compromise you can't always just have your way in the relationship just because you're dominant now just because you're not being a beta now or that you're alpha now you can't always have what you want like you, she want to do something all oh, you never nah like nah we ain't doing that nah you just you just because you don't bend to her will you're not being a simp but it ain't about that see what i'm saying you y'all get so caught up in trying not to get hurt and try not to mess up and try not to you know be how you was but you gotta understand that's a part of life anyway you gotta learn how to make mistakes and learn from them at some point even if you are alpha even if you are masculine dominant or red pill whatever you want to call yourself you're gonna mess up at some point you're not perfect nigga <laughs> did you forget you're not perfect you probably you probably get alpha quote unquote that's not even that's not even real you you, you that's something somebody else created alpha everybody has their own definition of what it means to be an alpha male so my version of an alpha male might not be the same version of what your alpha male might be you feel what i'm saying everybody's is different but I, i'm not even i don't even i'm i'm not i don't cause uh, i don't uh identify with none of that i'm not under that i'm not red pill i'm not alpha i'm not blue pill i'm not beta okay i, I don't identify with none of that because i'm my own thing because once i start doing that that's like it's like i'm under somebody i don't i don't you don't sign my checks i'm not under you i'm not under you okay and uh, now yeah i used to i used to be blue pill i used to be beta used to be red pill i used to be alpha but then i realized because because you well, all the stuff i'm saying you gotta understand stuff that i used to i used to be in the same mindset so when i was quote unquote alpha or red pill i got too in it like oh yeah I, I i gotta act this way i can't i can't let her break my heart i can't let her do none of this none of that now, i ain't gonna be better i refuse now I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna be no beta but you gotta you're not alpha or you're not beta you're yourself at the end of the day stop trying to uh stop calling yourself that that's something somebody else created getting back to the point you know of compromise and that's why i said on my own thing because i understand why compromise is so important so i don't identify with red pill or alpha or none of that or blue pill or beta even though i was at a point in time i guess you could say i was beta i was blue pill hell we all was. Uh, come on man we're growing up to this world we fed these lies about how you need to treat women 
you know, this type of way you need to be super nice, super do all these things for them, uh, you know, make sure that everything is perfect for her, you know, worship the ground she walk, walk on, you gotta do all this stuff, but, you know, that's wrong too, I, I agree, that's wrong, but at the same time, it's also wrong for you to just treat her like trash, something, somebody you can just dispose of, not get it? Some girls are just not worthy of your loyalty and your love. But you gotta understand, for the females who who are, for for somebody you could possibly make something work with, you gotta you gotta push that stuff to the side, okay? In the real world, because adults date and and two grown adults love each other, you gotta come to a compromise. You can't just oh this is how it's gonna be. This is my life. You're in it. You gotta do this or leave. Like you you, you gotta do this or it's no other way. It's either my way or the highway. You can't be like that. I don't care how alpha you are, I don't care how masculine, I don't care how dominant you are. If you keep doing that, your female gonna leave you. Because you're not giving no, you not, it's no middle ground, it's no compromise. Compromise is important. You have to compromise with your female. For all the men out there, y'all, y'all get into this mindset of I'm alpha now. That's great. I would I don't I don't encourage you to call yourself that but if you if that help you to have better success in dating all power to you but you're gonna be out in this dating world you gotta learn how to compromise okay you gotta be like you gotta be able to be like listen let's do this it's not exactly what I want but it's some it's somewhat of what I want and it makes us it makes you happy and it makes me it still makes me happy and it we still can be together and vice versa she gotta do the same thing hey this is not exactly what i want but it still makes me happy and it makes you happy and more importantly it makes us still be together we're still together because that's the end of the day you may not get exactly what you want on that part but you at in the end you always gonna get exactly what you want which is the other person getting getting to be with the other person so in the end you still getting exactly what you want the relationship with the other person getting to be with the other person so you getting what you want anyway but you just gotta sacrifice that's anything in life you gotta sacrifice you can't you know just have everything you want just like I said you know it's all about compromise and you know like if you single okay yeah, yeah, you you go around screw different girls. You can have sex. You can do all that. Uh huh. Yeah, you can you can you can have sex with as many girls as you want to. But you can't get home from a long day of work and have deep convers deep conversations with them. You can't be like you can't tell them about your day. You can't converse with them. You can't share deep personal stories and thoughts with them. You can't bond with them. You can't spend quality time with them. You can't have long hugs with them and do all that because they thoughts they just girls you sleeping with okay so yeah you having fun but you can't do all that like i said you can't have any deep connection with them see what i'm saying so yeah you get to screw but where's the deep connection you know what i'm saying you can't have both and and just like when you in a relationship it's gonna be some days when your girl just tired your girl don't want to have sex your girl just not gonna want to do nothing she might be on her menstrual she might be on her menstrual cycle or she might just don't feel like it. You got to and you're not going to be able to have sex when you want to all the time. Like be able to just call any girl up because you're in a relationship now and your girl might not be feeling like it a lot of times. So you got to be able to say, see what I'm saying? You're not going to, what I'm saying is you're not going to be able to have both. Not You're not going to be able to have, oh, I can sleep with any girl and then I can get deep conversations. No, you can't. You got to. You gotta choose what you want. You gotta have a compromise, okay? It's all about compromise. So any way you go, cause me, I'm a one woman man. All right, that's why. So, you know, I know what I want. So it's all about what you want, man. But they should. You well, you gotta be able to compromise. You can't just always. You you gotta think about your girl too. I right, you get it. Yes, that's attractive and sexy when you're dominant, when you're masculine with your woman, when you able to put her in her place when you able to bring the thrill the excitement and be financially stable and have provisioning power and you know and just be you know a strong shoulder she can lean on and be intimate 
and be a support system and all that be a strong foundation for him. You know what I'm saying? That those all those all the different elements you gotta master. Okay? Don't think of it as a challenge. Don't think of it as something like, oh, like it's a chore or something, like it's a job. Just just it's all the different stuff that you gotta know how to do, but just look at it as like a, a crazy ride that you you're gonna enjoy it, that you're gonna have fun on, like it's just a crazy uh roller coaster that you gonna enjoy having being with a woman. That's all you that's all different elements you gotta bring to the table. You gotta be thrilling to keep your woman. No nobody don't no girl wanna be with no boring man. If you're boring, she gonna cheat on you or she gonna leave you. It's that simple. If you're thrilling but you not don't have a future, you have no financial type of power, then she's gonna leave you for somebody who's thrilling, but he's financially stable too. See what I'm saying? It's all about having a combination, it's all about balance. Everything in life requires balance. If it balances out, then it it will bring harmony. That's what you will have, okay? But it's all about compromise. You can't just have it your way. She can't just have it her way. Y'all gotta meet somewhere in the middle where y'all can make each other happy and still be together. Boom, that's simple. Y'all make dating too hard. It's not that hard. Go up, talk to a girl. She don't like you. Keep going until you find a girl you got in common with. Talk to her. Get her number. Radiate the right type of energy. Have attractive traits. Either she like you or she don't. If she like you, move stuff to the next level. Escalate. Flirt with her. Seduce her. Boom. Bring it to the next level. You know, let her pursue the relationship. It's all y'all know what to do, man. It's, it's not that hard, man. It just, it's simple. It's supposed to be like peanut butter and jelly. Female meets an attractive man. A man meets an attractive female. They come together smoothly, cooperate. They build something beautiful. They make a family. Super simple. All this, the times we live in, and make it so difficult for no reason. That's the video. Stay positive. Have a good day and never give up.